It's time for 12 Talk, and tomorrow Montgomery Mayor Stephen Reed is set to deliver his annual State of the City address. This is his chance to talk directly to you, folks who live here in Montgomery, about the accomplishments of the past year and look ahead to the future. And Montgomery Mayor Stephen Reed is in the studio with us today to talk a little bit about what's in store for this State of the City address. I know last year focused a lot on things like crime and economy and job growth. What are you looking yeah. for this year? Well, you know, I think this year uh, provides us a great opportunity. First, thank you all for, for hosting me uh, today um, to talk about a lot of the good news that's happened since uh, last year, a lot of the accomplishments, whether it's around our homeless task force, whether it's around our Veterans Commission, certainly economic development has been uh, going very strong, right? Not as, as historic as 2022. That's hard to top uh, when you get $1.7 billion in. But this year, we're looking forward to seeing a lot of those projects actually come out of the ground. Uh, and that's positive because it means those jobs are one step closer to being a reality for all the folks in Montgomery and the rest of the region. But we also want to focus on public safety, uh, our public private partnership initiatives, and community development, some of the infrastructure work that we're doing, and things we're doing to rehabilitate uh, older properties and neighborhoods, and some of the other uh, announcements that we have for uh, key venues in our city. So I'll save a little bit for, for tomorrow. We don't want you to give everything away, but it does sound like the last 12 months and as we head into this new year have been a lot about building momentum. Yeah. How do we keep that momentum going? Well, I think we have to you know, really keep in mind that uh, there are a lot of great things happening in the city. It comes through collaboration with our partners at Montgomery County, our Chamber of Commerce, and our community. Uh, all of them play a role in the uh, opportunities that we have. And when I consider uh, where we are right now financially, from the city being in a very strong standpoint, to what we see in terms of building permits, housing permits, those are things that all trend in the right direction for me. And I think just having the opportunity to look at even some of the good news we see in our education space means that we're on a good path and we just have to continue to work together. Hey, I wanted to ask you, I know you recently returned from Washington, D.C. You were at the Conference of Mayors there. Talk yes. a little bit about how you advocated for the capital city, for the city of Montgomery, while well, you were in the in the nation's capital Well, city. yeah, you know, it, it's not every day that you get a chance to uh, talk to the Secretary of Treasury, uh, certainly um, Secretary of Labor, who was here in Montgomery, but education and, and as well as transportation. When you get those opportunities, you don't want to give them a laundry list. We go with kind of our top two or three items, but a lot of that stems around workforce development, investing and in supporting small businesses, and then making sure that from an infrastructure standpoint, uh, we're doing the right things to bring those federal dollars to the state and then from the state to the city. And I think in all of our conversations, there's a familiarity with Montgomery, there's a comfort level here, uh, and there's a willingness to partner with uh, our leadership uh, all across this community to help the president, uh, the president's administration, the president's vision really come to fruition regardless of the state, regardless of the city. And I think for us, that's a great opportunity that we got a chance to have. As we look ahead to tomorrow night, what is it you're hoping folks take away from, from your state of the city address? Well, I, I hope that people will see a lot of the good things that are happening here. I know often we, we get uh, information that, that's not positive, and we tend to hang on to that a lot longer than uh, we talk about those things that are happening in a good way. And so we want to highlight some of the things, again, that have taken place over the last several months, but also what our vision for 2024 is, and then ways they can play a role in helping us do just that. So we're looking forward to sharing the information with them. We're looking forward to seeing so many of our citizens come out and interact with our city council, as well as our other uh, cabinet leaders that we have from all the different departments in the city, and find out how we can be a more responsive and effective government. All right, Montgomery Mayor Stephen Reed, you are set to deliver that State of the City address tomorrow night at 6 o'clock at the Crampton Bowl Multiplex. If you can't be there in person, you can watch it live online on WSFA.com, also on our Facebook page and our YouTube channel.